Hello class, my name is Laura Conejo and I'm here with my group. This is my group. What's up? Hi. And we're all going to get a chance to say hello. But first I would like to start with a little introduction of what we did on the day of our community service. We went, we provided our service to Trinity Lutheran Community Church in the city of Montclair. We went there Saturday from 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. They hosted an event of food and clothing donation to help families in need. Unfortunately, we had a really good video for us to show you guys of us in action that day, but one of our classmates dropped out and took the video with her. So the show must go on though. We're here to record again our experience and tell you guys a little bit about what we did that day. So I'm going to pass over the mic to Jacob and he'll tell you a little bit about what he did that day. Hello everybody. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Jacob Debabne and I am with my group as Laura introduced us already. And my experience over at Trinity Church was amazing. And uh, we were involved in so many actions that were taking place over there. For instance, I got to interview the uh, leader of the church and it was amazing. Like she, it was a beautiful woman. Um, she was discussing how she gets involved with the community so much and outreaching anybody that she can. You know, it wasn't like a certain uh, sector of uh, people to attend the church. You know, it, it was for infants, for, you know, people that are over the age of 80. It, do it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what race, doesn't matter what's your status. We were all there to help. And um, I got to be involved in packaging food as some of the other members in my group as well. And um, that was pretty amazing because it was very, uh, very gratifying and very, uh, you know, it's a kind of overwhelming how much you got to take part in uh, giving to these people, you know, that were in need. And it was amazing, like talking with them, you know, they didn't mind talking to you, being open about anything. And it was amazing. Like you would, I had obviously the wrong judgment of these people from my first experience with them because I'm assuming I'm going to interact with people that are not stable and, um, just not be able to cope with themselves and it was the exact opposite so to be to be involved in those kind of actions and those kind of um wonderful things to be a part of like it was a great opportunity for me and it was a great experience to learn from it made me more i gained a lot of knowledge of what people are like in society today and it, we've been wrong we've been very wrong and like it's just it's a beautiful sight to see and it's a beautiful thing to be part of i recommend anybody to uh, be involved over there. They have Saturdays where they're willing for people to be uh, involved and like take part in like packaging foods and like assisting others with clothing and so on and so forth. And that's it really for me. And I'm gonna pass on to my next victim. Hi guys, this is Kathy. I wanna share my experience with you guys. Uh, the day, this, I think it was on Saturday, Two months ago, we went to the church in Montclair. Uh, that was a great experience because I never had it before. And I was in charge with the food packaging. And uh, to be honest with you, when I got there, I feel uh, weird. But uh, after 10 minutes, I realized that I shouldn't judge the people because they are low income or they don't, they don't have clothing or food. So I feel great because uh, I helped them I had no idea there is a the people they are uh, helping people they provide this stuff and they give it to them as a volunteer uh, unfortunately we made a good video last time but she uh, dropped the course and I asked an interview with the supervisor and the other volunteers but I'm gonna ask, uh, I'm gonna tell you the same question when I asked him. I asked the supervisor who's gonna provide these clothing and foods, and she said all people they provide, and, uh, and I asked them who's gonna um, clean it and put it in the box and make it ready to give it to them, and they said the same thing, the volunteer, they come to the church and they help them. And on that time I realized that, okay, I can, Next time I can go to the church and help them as a volunteer. Why not? They are human, they need clothing, they are not food. Why not? And um, uh, I was uh, the same thing. I told you I was in charge with the uh, last stop of uh, food they are taking. It was uh, beef, ground beef. I gave it to them, I put it in the bag and I gave it to them and they say thank you. They were very nice people, kind people, true people. You can't find all kind 
people in the world. They were, they were, they were very, um, well, what should I say, honest people. And uh, I'm so great. I have a good, uh, I had a good experience. And uh, I'm going to continue with this, go to the church, and I help to the people. Thank you. Hello class, this is Erica and I want to share my experience with you guys from our events. Um, going to volunteer to this place brought me many childhood memories of when my family was in need of clothes and food. Um, it brought me back to when my mom couldn't afford to buy us clothes and we went to places like this church where they helped so many families in need like my family was. and. It was an amazing experience to be able to help and I encourage everyone to donate their clothes, their shoes, um, and their time to help uh, so many families in need like my family was because I know that there's so, ma there's so many families out there that need our help. I know we have in our closets so many shoes, so many sweaters, so many um, jackets, blankets, so many things that we don't even use and so many families out there. Um, you know, need uh, things that we don't use anymore, especially in the winter, blankets, sweaters, you know, and so I just encourage everyone to please help. And it's, it's an amazing feeling to do it. Yes, my name is Lema. I really enjoyed my experience. I helped people sign in and led them to food and clothing location. I met a beautiful lady who helped me a lot to communicate with people that come to the event. My sister also was there to help us. Uh, after this experience, I know now how to help by donating clothes and canned food to church like this. Hello class. Well, lastly, I want to share my experience. I want to let you guys know that there is a need out there. And I know we all have items that are in, stuck in a closet. We no longer wear. We don't even look at it. Um, I want to encourage you guys to get those items in a box and go and donate these items to churches like these that provide help to the needy. There's a lot of need out there. We have to be united. We help to help each other if we can. And I know we can. Also, if you don't have anything to give, donate a few hours to come help these people gather up all the items and give to the needy. Um, I want to thank my group for the great effort. I want to I want to let you guys know that there were awesome people to work with. We got our project done and everybody's still happy with each other. And well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and we'll see you guys soon. Bye.